Have you ever wondered if we could live on Pluto? The idea might sound like a plot from a futuristic sci-fi novel, but it's a question that tickles the curiosity of many. Pluto, a dwarf planet situated in the cold, far-flung reaches of our solar system, has always been a subject of fascination. Discovered in the early 20th century, this celestial body was once considered the ninth planet from the Sun. However, its status was later demoted to that of a dwarf planet, a decision that sparked a heated debate among the scientific community and beyond. Despite its icy demeanor, Pluto holds a certain charm that draws us towards the intriguing possibility of life beyond our blue planet. Could we as humans ever call this distant icy world home, or is it just a fantasy confined to the realms of science fiction? Now, we dive into the realm of science and imagination, exploring the possibility of life on Pluto. First off, we need to understand Pluto's environment. Pluto, the dwarf planet at the edge of our solar system, has an environment that is as unique as it is harsh. The first thing that strikes you about Pluto's environment is the cold. It's not just chilly or frosty, it's bone-chillingly, mind-numbingly cold. Temperatures here can drop to more than 400 degrees below zero Fahrenheit, which is colder than anything we experience on Earth. This extreme cold would instantly freeze any exposed human tissue, turning it as hard as rock. Not only that, but Pluto also has a very thin atmosphere. It's so thin that it's about 100,000 times less dense than Earth's atmosphere. That's so thin that if you were to try and take a breath, you'd be gasping for air. This lack of atmosphere also means there's no protective layer to shield the surface from cosmic radiation. This constant bombardment of cosmic rays would be lethal to humans without proper protection. Then there's the issue of sunlight, or rather the lack of it. Pluto is about 3 billion miles away from the sun. That's about 40 times further than Earth. This means that the sunlight that does reach Pluto is so dim that it would look like twilight on Earth, even at high noon. This lack of sunlight would make it extremely difficult for humans to see, and it could also have serious effects on our mental health. And let's not forget about the terrain. Pluto's surface is covered with mountains of ice that are as tall as the Rockies, and vast plains of frozen nitrogen. This harsh terrain would make any movement difficult and dangerous. So, to sum it up, the environment on Pluto is incredibly harsh. It's freezing cold, there's barely any atmosphere, sunlight is scarce, and the terrain is treacherous. Simply put, Pluto's environment is brutal and unforgiving. So, what would be the challenges of living on Pluto? Right off the bat, the lack of breathable air presents a significant hurdle. Unlike the oxygen-rich atmosphere we enjoy here on Earth, Pluto's air primarily consists of nitrogen with minor traces of methane and carbon monoxide. Let's just say that without a supply of oxygen, we'd have to rely heavily on advanced life support systems to stay alive. Next, we'd have to contend with the extreme cold. It's not just chilly on Pluto, it's downright frigid. Temperatures can plummet to a bone-chilling minus 375 degrees Fahrenheit. To put this into perspective, even the coldest temperature ever recorded on Earth is balmy compared to a warm day on Pluto. Survival would demand the most advanced insulation and heating technologies we have at our disposal. Then there's the matter of gravity, or rather the lack of it. Pluto's gravity is only about 6% as strong as Earth's. This means our bones and muscles would weaken over time, posing a serious health risk. We'd need to develop rigorous exercise routines and possibly even new medical treatments to combat these effects. Don't forget about isolation. Pluto is, on average, over 3 billion miles away from Earth. That's not exactly a quick trip. The isolation would be extreme, and communication with Earth would be delayed by several hours. Psychological resilience would be just as important as physical strength. Finally, there's the journey itself. Even at the speed of our fastest spacecraft, it would take us about nine and a half years to get to Pluto. That's a long time to be cooped up in a spaceship and it doesn't even include the time it would take to establish a viable living environment once we arrive. Indeed, living on Pluto would be a monumental challenge. But as we've seen throughout history, human ingenuity often rises to meet the most daunting of challenges. Will we one day call Pluto home? Only time will tell. Could humans adapt to these harsh conditions? That's the billion dollar question. The human body is a marvel of adaptability. But let's consider the monstrous circumstances we'd be up against on Pluto. Firstly, there's the physical aspect. The human body is optimized for conditions on Earth, where gravity, temperature, and radiation levels are just right. But on Pluto, we'd be grappling with an environment that's over 300 degrees below freezing, bathed in cosmic radiation, and where gravity is only one-sixth of what we're used to. 
our bodies would need to cope with these drastic changes. For instance, less gravity would weaken our muscles and bones over time. The extreme cold would require us to conserve as much heat as possible, and the radiation would pose a constant health risk. Then there's the psychological aspect. The isolation, the darkness, and the sheer alienness of Pluto could take a toll on our mental health. Humans are social creatures, and living in such an inhospitable environment, far from the warmth and familiarity of Earth, could lead to stress, anxiety, and a host of other psychological issues. But fear not, for technology might be our savior. Advanced spacesuits could protect us from the cold and radiation, and artificial gravity could help maintain our physical health. Habitats could be designed to mimic Earth's conditions, with indoor parks and virtual reality simulations to help us feel less isolated. We could even use telecommunication technology to stay connected with our loved ones back home. Of course these are just potential solutions, we're still a long way from making them a reality. But as we've seen throughout history, humans have an uncanny ability to adapt and innovate in the face of adversity. We've evolved from cave dwellers to astronauts, from horse riders to jet pilots, the human species is adaptable but living on Pluto would test our limits. Despite the challenges, could we ever live on Pluto? This question might seem a bit far-fetched now, but let's take a look at the possibilities that the future might hold. Advancements in technology are rapidly transforming our world and expanding our horizons. As we delve deeper into the realm of space exploration, the potential for future technology to make life on Pluto a reality cannot be entirely dismissed. We're talking about cutting-edge developments in terraforming, artificial habitats and space travel that could potentially make the inhospitable conditions of Pluto livable for humans. There's a tremendous scientific interest in Pluto. This distant, icy dwarf planet holds many secrets that could provide us with valuable insights into the origins of our solar system and the universe. By establishing a base on Pluto, we could expand our understanding of these mysteries, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and capabilities. Imagine a base on Pluto serving as a stepping stone for further exploration into the Kuiper Belt and beyond. Such a base could also act as a research station, allowing scientists to study Pluto's unique environment up close and personal. The potential benefits are immense, from unlocking the secrets of cosmic evolution to perhaps even discovering new resources or forms of life. Moreover, living on Pluto could redefine our perspective of survival and adaptability. It could teach us to thrive in extreme environments, a vital skill that might be required as we venture further into the cosmos. But let's not get carried away. The path to life on Pluto is fraught with colossal challenges. We would need to overcome extreme temperatures, lack of atmosphere and the vast distance from Earth, to name just a few. Yet, it's important to remember that every great journey begins with a single step, and who knows, Perhaps one day the footprints of that step will be etched into the icy surface of Pluto. While the challenges are enormous, the future may hold the possibility of life on Pluto. To sum up, is Pluto our next home? Well, we've journeyed through the intriguing idea, dived deep into the brutal environment and grappled with the enormous challenges of making such an extreme place our home. We've even examined the potential for human adaptation, the incredible ways we might evolve to survive in such a harsh landscape. From the extreme cold, to the thin atmosphere, to the long, dark winters, Pluto is not for the faint of heart. Yet, we've also explored the incredible potential for future advancements, the ways technology might make living on this distant dwarf planet a reality. We've seen that, while fraught with difficulties, there's also a hint of possibility. The future, after all, is a place of endless potential filled with the unknown and the yet to be discovered. And so we end with the question we began with, but perhaps with a deeper understanding. For now, living on Pluto remains a fascinating but distant possibility, yet who knows what the future holds.